Luke Phillips as well, and Matt Leary. Well, for the visitors, Keats, Touch, Google, Holcomb, and Moe. in a little bit of trouble that time getting into the air. That time, nice inbounds play and pass to Holcomb for the easiest ball. Moe hits the three and fouled by Luke Phillips. Getting through there and uh, the slammers have come up with it. Tough pass and great grab by Moe Touch. Holcomb muscles his way inside. He's a big unit. Keats, plenty of confidence in him from the coach. He pulls one from three, that one's off the mark, maybe a little bit hasty. Is that Moe with an easy score down, down inside? So I'm on board with it. <laughs> very interesting, it's an interesting tackle. Good defensive unit, the Slammers. We mentioned Holcomb leading the league. Down to the last 10 seconds of this quarter. Turnover to Vianina. Phillips should throw this down. Gets upstairs and does the work. Cotton shows a little bit of athleticism in that one. That was, that was uh, looking like a mighty dunk. A prom absorbs the contact. And he went to the line for the end one. Well, one of my offense has been working. It's shut down by the Hawks in that yeah. one of my stands. Credit the Hawks, they have been able to step up their defense somewhat. Phillips gets his way to the basket. AJ to Bensi to Hamilton. It's perhaps a bit of a risky one. Keats finds himself with a little bit of space to work with and he makes it. He needs a stand up point guard. But I think he'd be a great option for the Euroleague where they always look for those kinds of players. Jonko with the score down the other end. No, he always does it. He always manages to get to that left hand and just lay it in front of the rim. No one's really figured it out yet. We touch, elevates. Easy score for him. I oh, will let uh, Devin Craig do the ball mounting duties. Finds him again in the corner. Almost stepped a little too far back. Gets it to Holcomb who throws that one down nice and easy. They still find themselves in an eight-point hole. Still not enough time, eight minutes 30. But they need someone to heat up. Possibly could have been a bit disappointed for a foul, but touch gets upstairs. Slammers. Happy enough to take a, a little bit of air out of the ball, potentially. Back door and get upstairs. Iverson tried to go behind. Gets it up there. Jonker almost. Snellgrove will dribble it out now. And that's will be the full-time score here for the Bendak Basketball Centre. 